I just passed the, the American border. I'm on a train to California. This is probably a really dumb idea. But here I am. I'm getting a prefab cheeseburger. Cover up the branding there. One of my first train rides since I was like 10 years old. I'm going to be doing this for the next like, three, four days. It's going to be pretty cool. And also pretty boring. Next stop, Buffalo. Buffalo. Sunny, wonderful Buffalo. I actually had no idea what to expect from, from this place. I've never been here before. Uh, actually, everywhere I'm going on this trip, I've never been before. But uh, I got off near the airport, and I assumed it would be warehouses, but I actually managed to find some vestiges of civilization. I've been hanging out in a grocery store where there's all kinds of Wi-Fi and a lovely cafe where I'm going to have dinner. And because my next train leaves at midnight, for the next leg of my journey to VidCon, which will end in at 10 a.m. tomorrow in Chicago, if everything goes well, which it probably should, it already has. Um, by the way, explaining VidCon to border guards is a challenge. Um, I don't know any other way to explain it. I, he's like, you, you're going, you're going to a conference and, and, and a convention. I said, yeah. So you're on business. I'm like, no, 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 no. This is something I do for fun. I make videos. He says, okay. So why do you make videos? Because I like doing it. But this is my next stop before, well, not quite before California. Chicago's the real test. Um, because after Chicago, I get on a train for 40 some odd hours. And I cross an entire country. And I go farther away from home than I have ever been before in my life. And I'm doing it all by myself, which is new for me. I usually travel with people. I don't like traveling alone. Um, I'm getting used to it, though. It's a lot of fun. I get to spend a lot of time with uh, my second favorite person in the world. I don't know who my first favorite person in the world, but I probably like them more than me. Oh, man. Anyway, I am starving, and I have a bunch of work to do. Uh, because, of course, I'm working on stuff. I'm updating my website and finishing blog posts for next week because I don't want to be writing during VidCon. Well, I do want to be writing during VidCon, but I don't want to be writing about VidCon. And I was hoping I'd find some really strange American stuff, but I haven't. Everything's pretty ordinary. I think it's because I'm just across the border. Maybe in Chicago things will get weird. But stay tuned for more train footage and talking and weirdness. So next stop... Chicago. Chicago. I am two-thirds of the way there, although not really because I don't even have time to get a feel for this city. In like an hour, I'm back on a train for two days straight to LA. At which point I will go to Anaheim, at which point I will go to VidCon, and it will be awesome. I am rapidly getting sort of more and less nervous, but more and more excited as I get closer. I now have internet access in the United States, which is without costing me a huge fortune, which is awesome. And yeah, see you guys on the train. So I've been on the train for about a day now. And, uh, sleeping on a train is much more challenging than I had previously imagined. We are just in between sort of Colorado, New Mexico. So much space. I mean, there's just so much room here. I mean, I've come from Canada, which is larger than the U.S., but I haven't really seen a lot of it. I'm mostly an urban creature. But, and I assume similar vistas exist in my country. Ooh, a cell tower. That means I have reception. Crazy. But yeah. On my way to VidCon still. <laughs> I keep thinking about what I want to do there. I mean, apart from meet YouTubers and have fun and go to workshops and learn things. I mean, I want to learn how to do all the stuff that I do better. And I really want to meet some cool people. I'm a little nervous about it. I get, I get anxious sometimes uh, when I'm going, when I'm traveling alone to a new place where there is no one that I know. So I'm trying to talk about it on the internet and 
to see if I can prearrange some stuff. I get there a couple days before the con the conference actually starts, so I can crash in my hotel room and take a shower. But yeah, I'm about a day and a half out of Anaheim now. And I have to say, taking the train, still a good idea. Really enjoying it. It's really relaxing. Uh, it's no longer freezing cold, thanks to my recently purchased yellow fleece blanket. Because, oh my god, it's so cold last time. My seatmate was huddled up in her jacket. Oh my god, I should have brought a jacket. But I thought, oh, California in the summertime. Why would I need a jacket? Because trains are cold. Trains are cold. Seriously, that's my biggest complaint, and I'm doing pretty all right. I keep looking at the hydro lines here. Like, these are old hydro lines. Like, some of these are probably 50, 60 years old. I mean, the trees are, are even older. Most of this country just seems to be made of dust and shrubs. I don't know. I kind of want to see more of them now. This is how people get the travel bug, I feel. I also kind of want to take the train back, even though I'm not. I'm totally going to fly because I really need to get home and you know, go, go to my job. But, day and a half more to go until L.A. and then on to Anaheim and then on to VidCon. Right, see ya. I'm not on a train! My hair is totally messed up. Ugh. No, I am in Los Angeles. I have been on a train for 44 hours. Which actually wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. I met some really cool people. I met a couple really weird people. Not not like weird cool, but weird weird. But, uh... Now they have palm trees. Holy crap, palm trees. I've never seen palm trees before. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm here for like an hour. And then I catch my final train up to Anaheim. And then I'm going to go to my hotel and sleep. And edit this video but mostly sleep because it has now been four days since I slept in a bed of any kind and I am kind of looking forward to it. So I'm going to attempt to grab some LA food and maybe see as much of LA as possible in the next hour before my train shows up. And next stop, Anaheim. Anaheim. I am in you. It's true, I'm here. Um, at the Boba Gump Shrimp Company because we don't have these in Canada and I like shrimp. So I'm going to eat some shrimp. You can hear the blues travel in the background, uh, which is awesome. How are you doing, sir? I am doing awesome. Excellent. Am I interrupting anything? Uh, not at all. This is JJ, my server. Oh, how are you going to take my order. <laughs> are, you on, are you on vacation? I just had to order my food. I am hint, I'm getting a lot of shrimp because I have been eating leftover deep dish pizza for the past four days. Uh, well, no, more like two and a half. But, yeah, it's so good, but I'm a little sick of it. And, and then I will go to my hotel and check in and shower and shave. <laughs> Best drink ever. All it is is ice water. I'm so excited to be here in Anaheim and keep running into people. We're going to VidCon. They're all super awesome, like the girl on the train with the... The Fault in Our Stars shirt. I was like, oh my god! Everybody I met on the train was super cool. I mean, except for the one weird guy, but. Yeah. No, like, my excitement has just ramped up. Now that I'm, I'm still tired from traveling, but I don't care. I'm just so stoked to be here. Uh, so, my next video will actually be a VidCon video. I will be, I don't know, seeing people and doing things and figuring stuff out. I really actually have no plans. My whole goal not to forget to be awesome. I'll see you guys later.